Well, I don't know if you could clearly define uh, commercial fishing as a job. It's uh, more or less a, a, a lifestyle. And my thoughts, my mentality was that water. See, I was born in the water. This is Corsan right here. Of course, uh, years ago, we, we, we shrimped in Pampico Sound and, and, uh, and, Use, and Use River. But, but we're down east, Carter County. We've been here a, a better than a 200 year history here. So some of these people lived in virtual isolation. That intensified, reinforced <laughs> the traditions, their abilities to fish and uh, to build boats. I mean, all this was just reinforced. They know who they are and they know where they're from. I mean, there's an incredible sense of place here. That's what has made this area what it is. To me, it's the people. A lot of people like, uh, like beaches, like condos, and like a hot tubs and all this other stuff. I just like to be left alone and be living. These are people who are still attuned to the environment and to their history. This is not just what they have always done. This is what they want to do. I'm a family man and I love the water and I want to work and catch fish and I want to go washing and I want and I go scalloping and I want to go shrimping and I'm going to keep doing it as long as I can. I'm more, I'm, more, I'm one of the ones that's going to keep struggling and do it as long as I can keep my head afloat and keep something to eat on my table. I'm going to do it. It has never been harder than right now to be a commercial fisherman. If this was a a rational decision, nobody would be out there doing it. It's about culture. It's about people doing what they love. 